Dr. Andrew Huberman is the number one health and fitness podcaster in the world. He's sponsored by a ton of products and I bought them all. Today, I'm gonna tell you, are they worth it? Or is it just a scam? Let's test these bad boys out. First up, we have AG1, or also known as Athletic Greens. This is special green powder that you're supposed to take on a daily basis. And the biggest thing that I've learned, if you take supplements and they actually work, that means you're not eating the proper diet. I actually bought this a long time ago and I am extremely lazy and I have struggled with actually using this stuff. But supposedly it's really good. If you're not the type of person to take it at night, maybe you could take this in the morning. Do you have a $10 bill by chance? I have tried this and you really have to mix it. So it, it is a bit of a hassle to kind of mix this and then you gotta make sure the bottle's clean. I don't do a good job of keeping the bottle clean and nor do I do a good job of actually mixing it every day. And it doesn't fully dissolve in the water so you're gonna have a little bit of flavoring. It tastes like green stuff. So it's just something to be mindful of. Man, this is like whole kilo bro, right? <laughs> this would sell on the black market for a lot. I hope my credit card still works. But overall, like it's good insurance if you're not eating 100% properly. They have little travel kits that you can use. And then I like to store this nice container in the fridge. And then they also have this vitamin D3 plus K2 that you can just put under your tongue. I think this is a lot easier to consume. And pills are even easier to consume because you don't have to actually mix it. Which brings us to our next Angie Huberman sponsor, which is Thorn. So if you're a sucker like me and you just buy every single product he talks about, I got the protein, vegan protein, electrolytes, and a whole bunch of other supplements. In terms of how good they are, I honestly can't tell because I'm not a science lab, but in terms of ease of use, pills for me are the easiest to consume. Protein powders are the next easiest, like I'll try to make a shake, but sometimes it's still struggle. And then electrolytes are even easier because I can just mix it in a Gatorade bottle and they just mix with water the best. I would say this kind of requires a blender, but the flavors are pretty good. I've got the vanilla flavored here and the vanilla as well. You know, I try to keep it simple. I add in a little bit of fruit, put it in a blender, it tastes great. These are solid, they're very expensive, but if they're supplements, I would ideally like high quality supplements. So that's kind of uh, why I went with Thorn, and they do have a lot of NSF certified supplements, so I think that's important to make sure you're getting the best quality. Maybe we'll test at a lab. If anyone knows a lab that we can test supplements at, I would love to you know, make that happen for a future video. But Andrew Huberman left Thorn for another company, and that is called Momentus. I do have all these products linked down below. Use code SHERVIN to help support the channel. And Thorn doesn't give me a code, but Momentus does, so it makes sense why Huberman left Thorn for Momentus. Very similar branding, it feels clean, aesthetic, like it looks high quality, so it must be, right? I bought most of this stuff and they sent me like one of these things. For the most part, I haven't opened these powdered bags just because you have to use a blender. Once again, sometimes I can be lazy. But they do make like collagen shots, which are really easy to consume. And I did end up buying a whole bunch of their supplements as well. So I have transitioned, just like Huberman did, to using mostly momentous supplements. I think this is a bit excessive. No one should ever need this many supplements. But I'm doing experiments for this channel. So like, for example, we're doing a testosterone supplements video coming soon. We're testing out Tomcat Ali and Fidoja Agrestis. So those bad boys are right here and supposedly they increase testosterone, so I'm doing a blood test before and after, and I'll tell you one thing, it might have worked. Another thing, they're also mostly NSF certified supplements, which is convenient and nice, so I appreciate that. But like I said before, if you're not eating right, that's the only time most supplements will work. So get your diet right, eat whole foods, eat healthy, eat some good stuff. Which brings us to our next sponsor, which is a whole food sponsor. I was excited to see that it's not just supplements that are sponsoring Huberman. This is wild Hawaiian venison. It's ground and it is expensive. This is probably the most expensive meat I've ever held in my hand. It's like 26 US dollars, I think. But I, I ate one last night and whew, the meat tastes amazing. Colt, well, what'd you think? Pretty good. Pretty good? He says I cooked it a little too much. So today, we're gonna cook some more. This is ground, you can make burgers, you can make meatballs, whatever you want. So step one, get a dish pan. Step two, tin foil for easy cleaning. Place it in this Brava dish pan. Step five, violently rip open the Maoni Wild Tennyson. Okay, maybe not violently, we'll do it nicely. Always, always handle your meat gently, right? Did I say Tennyson? Will Tennyson, this is our ground venison. You wanna touch it? Look, it's all gooey. It feels really nice, like. So I'll make little balls here, cause that's what I'm used to holding in my hands. Oh, uh, like, cause we have like massage balls and things like that. The end goal is how can I get this meat into my mouth as fast as possible, right? Next step is to take the bloody wrapper. So this is the Mauni Wild Hawaiian Venison Ground. And they have a whole bunch of other meats as well, but this is just 
the one I prefer. All right, we need pepper, salt and pepper. If I should be adding any other spices, please let me know. And then my favorite is uh, Celtic sea salt. Just douse it in electrolytes. Hey, Gordon Ramsay, did I do a good job? All right, so now that is our ground venison right there. Shove it into the brava and it's gonna automatically cook it. I'm just gonna select ground beef. Let's go a little less than usual. Slide that sucker in. Bam, now it's gonna sear the meat and we'll be good to go. Speaking of Celtic sea salt, there is another one that Huberman is sponsored by. LMNT, sodium, potassium, magnesium. This is like a great electrolyte mix if you're gonna work out. There's no calories. If you're fasting in the morning, they come in little travel packets, which is nice, but also wasteful. It is very convenient. So if you're going to the gym, I can just toss this into my bag if I'm traveling. It is a little pricier end. You could make this on your own if you really wanted to. Just buy raw sodium, potassium, and magnesium and just make your right mix. But I like to buy Gatorade Zero. You know, a little bit of electrolytes here. And then when I'm done with it, I will just fill it up with water and put a little bit of this electrolyte white powder mix into here. Is that right? No, it's in there, right? And then we'll just mix it up and drink it. It tastes super salty. Like, it's like raw salt. It's not gonna be sweet. I, li I like the taste after like some time. Like, it's just like, oh, I want something salty. It tastes good, it's refreshing. Oh, all right. I'm honestly getting tired of all this stuff and I need some energy. And that's where the next sponsor comes in. Ketone 2.0. Daily ketone supplements. As you can see, I've almost finished a bottle. Each bottle costs around 250 US dollars and each shot is more than a night out in New York City. And it says here, sustained energy, mental clarity, endurance, weight management, longevity, metabolic health, even solves cancer. That is a joke. We're gonna do about 35 milliliters. And I'll tell you one thing, this tastes, or it smells like alcohol, but not really. And the aftertaste, is disgusting. Colt, you want a shot? No. Why not? Dude, that's disgusting. Oh, are you sure? Yep. Yeah, I tried to get my roommates to try it and they absolutely hate it. So get a chaser ready. Two is that it can really flush out your digestive system. So be near a restroom because you might have to go there and everything just slides out real fast to put it loosely. Loosely. I actually feel like I do get a spike of energy because there are two energy sources in our body, glucose and then ketones. Glucose being like sugar, ketones being a little more rare, but the faces people have to make drinking this stuff and the aftertaste does not go away even with a chaser. So let's do this. Okay, I can't do it. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna do it. Maybe a pre-chaser, post-chaser. Oh, that tastes like college. Fun fact, Andrew Huberman and I went to the same undergrad. UC Santa Barbara, Gauchos, let's go. But look where he ended up, making an impact on the world. And I'm out here drinking ketones. Okay, it was not that bad. Oh, it was that bad. But then about like 10, 15 minutes, <coughs> I'm gonna be energized. It's worth it, right? <laughs> All right, we're done with that. That stuff's expensive, powerful, and disgusting. All right, this is something he hasn't talked about. It's kind of like from the early days, but they are Roca glasses. So a lot of you have been commenting, where do you get your glasses from? These are Warby Parker with transition lenses. You can get transitions on almost any glasses. And these are the new Roca ones. They look very similar. There are no transition lenses, but I actually like them. They look sick, like they're clear. They're just like sleek and they're not really there, but they're there so I can see. My vision really changes. Now I can see that there's a camera. But what's nice with these glasses, there's a ridge on the inside. And if I'm sweating and I'm running and I'm wearing these glasses, they won't slide off. Whereas the Warby Parkers do. So I really like that. And then there's also a ridge on the inside of this piece right here. So right behind my ear. So they won't slip off my ears as well. So it's just nice to have those two areas of support where if I'm working out, I can wear these glasses and I know they won't slide off because I tend to sweat a lot. And because I'm not only a Andrew Huberman fan, but also a Nick Bear fan, I ended up buying the Roca Plus BPN glasses. Go one more, baby. If you haven't seen the Nick Bear video, go watch that. These are kind of like outdoor running glasses, cycling glasses. All right, I look like uh, I'm Whoa, from space. Oh, is that Nick Bear? <laughs> I'm Nick Bear, guys. He doesn't grow a beard like me, does he? But bam, call me Nick Bear. I'm a hybrid athlete now. All of a sudden, I can run six minute miles for 25 years, nonstop. I don't know, these are nice, they're kind of flexible. It feels very, very light, like they're extremely light. There's also ridges around the ears, so they stay in place. The nose bridge has a little section, so if I'm sweating, it's like silicone, it won't fall off. The lenses are super thin, it's gonna protect my eyes from the wind, from bugs running into my face. So let's go one more on this tag right here, as well as Roca up on the side. 
So if you're trying to rep the brand, you can feel cool and wear that. I was not able to get these in prescription. My eyesight's like good enough where I could probably use these without it. So maybe I should throw the box away and actually use these for once. I think they're kind of nice. I don't know if there's any big benefit to other glasses. If you're just starting to run, save your money, get something cheap, let it break. Then it's time to upgrade. But these supposedly have a lifetime warranty. And they even wrote me a little handwritten note. Shervin, thank you. That's awesome. Hand built in Austin, Texas. Thank you, Roka. Links for everything are down below. You can use code Shervin if you want to get a discount for buying anything. All right, next up is a fitness wearable. It is called the Whoop Strap. This is the Whoop 4.0. I like to wear this on my bicep. There it is. It's like a heart rate monitor, sleep tracker. I feel like I'm on a TV show like QVC. This is modern QVC. If you buy now, use the link below. You'll save $2.99 per month. Just call us at 1-800-BUY-THIS-PRODUCT and you don't need it. <laughs> but yeah, this is the Whoop 4.0. I have a review on this. I love this product. My favorite thing is the journal feature where I will actually input data on if I drank alcohol, if I slept with a cold room, if I ate close to bedtime. And then it's gonna give me monthly reports on how that type of stuff impacts my sleep. So I love that it's always on, it's always tracking me. Since I do always wear things on my wrists, I'll put the Whoop on my bicep. They also have clothing, they have swimsuits and you can slide the little heart rate monitor chip into the swimsuits or the clothing. Did you hear that? That means our Will Tennyson is pretty cooked. Imagine we're eating another YouTuber. My favorite thing about the Brava is I don't have to think about if the stove is cooking, right? I can film this video and it's gonna notify me when it's time. So I'll just kinda move those around a bit and slide this sucker back in. All right, whoop. Comes with a little battery puck charger here. This is the device that you plug in and charge via USB-C. When this is fully charged, you slide it on, and now this will charge your Whoop while you're wearing it. So you never really have to take it off. Is it a good thing? No. Why? Oh God! <laughs> because this gets really disgusting and you need to get a new strap. I need to buy a new strap. One thing I recommend is replace it every couple months. Get a new strap, throw away your old one. Don't keep it, you don't need it, it smells like but this is the white one, it's gotten kind of black. I've worn it for way too long. And because I work out and shower like twice a day, the moisture just develops on here and it, you know, it smells like me after not showering for four months. Great sleep and fitness tracker. I love it, link below. But this is not the only sleep and fitness tracker he's sponsored by. The other one is Eight Sleep. And I can't really bring the mattress in here, so maybe we'll just talk about it. It's a smart mattress, it cools each side of the bed. It's going to temperature regulate. You can have one side be 110 degrees Fahrenheit, the other side be 55 degrees Fahrenheit. It vibrates to wake you up gently, right, in the right sleep stage. And it changes the temperature throughout the night, so when you're getting into bed, it can be really hot, really cold, and then it'll adjust accordingly to the different sleep stages that you have. And it will also track your sleep, so it'll give you insights. How are you sleeping? And if there are two people on the bed, you can actually get sleep tracking for both people on each side. So it's one unit, and you can just get the cover if you want, put it over the mattress that you have today, or you can get the mattress and the cover together if you're trying to get a whole new entire bed. So I have a ton of videos on the eight sleep as well, the whoop strap, so you can go watch those but I really love both of them. They're linked below. All right, we got fitness, we got sleep. What about diet tracking? That is where Levels Health comes in. So Levels will send you a continuous glucose monitor from two different brands. This is one example. You will take this device, you'll stick it on the backside of your arm, pop, inserts a CGM into your arm and it will track your glucose levels throughout the day. You can input your food. You can automatically drag in your sleep and fitness data from like your Whoop or Apple Watch. And then it's gonna give you trends and data in terms of how are you eating, how does your diet, your exercise, your lifestyle behaviors impact your glucose levels and how can you change that to live a healthier life. Another one of my favorite products, I don't use this as often as the Whoop and the Eight Sleep, but I try to use it every three to four months. Looks like our venison is ready. I'm not gonna lie, this is probably one of my favorite sponsors out of all of them. Bam, it is ready to eat. This tastes like better than any other kind of ground beef that I bought. It smells fresh. I don't know, what does that even mean? Really tangy, deep flavor. Like it's really strong flavor. It's not too firm to eat. I don't know, it tastes like bones. Have you ever had like the inside of a bone? I love that flavor, but it just tastes like really nice meat. Sorry, I don't know my meat that well, but that's the best analogy I can give you. Colt, you want a bite here? Eat up, eat up, here you go. How does it taste? Mm. Are you not just saying that for the camera? No, it's good. Looky better than ground beef. It better be, it's five times the price. <laughs> I like it. I love to mix with this onions, spinach, whatever it is, bam. That's a nice meal right there. 85 grams of protein, get a little bit of veggies, bien. 
All right, last but not least is Inside Tracker. So, Inside Tracker is a blood test. They can either come to your home or you can go to like a Quest Diagnostics and they'll draw your blood, get it like seven vials, a lot of blood. And they'll give you data on terms of your hormone levels, your nutrient levels, the basic complete blood plan that you can do at your doctor plus a whole bunch of other things. I do this every three to six months. I think it's extremely valuable to make sure that like I'm within range. I've been using it for a lot of videos as well to test like, okay, if I do X experiment, like I'm taking a supplement or changing a lifestyle behavior, how does that impact my blood levels and the nutrient levels in my blood? I recommend trying to get a blood test through your doctor first. Maybe if you wanna do another one every three to six months, do it through Inside Tracker. But I do have a video on that, more coming soon as well. I think it's pretty valuable. It is on the pricier end, and I think it's someone who's really trying to invest in getting their health data at a more detailed level than you might be able to at your doctor, because sometimes they'll be a hassle trying to prescribe XYZ blood tests. I've tested them all. Some of them have videos. Go check them out, go watch them. Follow me on Instagram and Twitter at Shervin Shares. If you do plan to purchase any of these products, use code Shervin or the links down below. They help support the channel and I greatly appreciate it. This video is not sponsored by any of these companies, but I do have those affiliate links. And since you enjoyed this video, go watch my other videos on where I test all of Huberman's different strategies and ideologies, linked right here.